What's up, everybody? It's your man, Jay Field from HowToMakeVerySickBeats.com. If this is your first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. Today, we're going to talk about an easy way to chop up samples and put them on your pads with the MPC 500, 1000, or 2500. So let's get into it. Yeah. Quick question for you guys. Write this in the comments. Who participated in this year's black friday or cyber monday because i know everybody everybody gets emails coming from everywhere so let me know did you did you participate and if you did what you buy what did you get i'll be curious to know i get this question a lot how do you put your pad how, how do you put your samples on your pads or how do you slice because the MPC 500 is a headache, and I don't even I don't even slice. I just like to have my samples all ready, all ready to go, and just put them on the pads. So I do that with MPC Made. So the first thing you got to do, go on Google, type in MPC Made. Uh, just MPC Made, right? First thing that pops up, click on that, right? So. You got MPC made. It tells you what it is. It works for MPC 1000, 2500, or the 500. All right. So then you just download it. Boom. Takes you to this. Now I did all all this already, so I'm not gonna go through. I just wanted to show you where you can get it. All right. So boom. Done. So I'm gonna open it up. I'm gonna show you what you can do. This is it. NPC made. NPC made. You notice you got 12 pads. Now, if you're using the 1000 or the 2500, all you got to do is go to preferences. Right? And you can choose 1000 and, and that applies to the 2500 as well. And then that will give you 16 pads. Okay, so now all you got to do is whatever you know sounds that you have you just drag them whatever sounds you drag them onto these pads you know what i'm saying and it's just that simple um right now what i'm gonna do is i have this sample right here and i'm gonna chop that up so i'm gonna drag that onto slices chop slices right i'm gonna drag that on here See how simple that is? And it already chopped it up for me. Now you can adjust this, but I'm gonna just leave it, I'm gonna just leave it alone, leave it standard. And then you can name it however you want to, and then export it. And it just exported all those chops onto my desktop. So what you could do from that point is create a folder. I'm gonna name that folder the same name choppy and then I'm going to drag all those sounds including the program because it creates a program I'm going to put all that all that into this folder so now everything is in this own personal folder now how do you get this into your NPC got to show you so you take you take your USB cable and hook it up to your computer that's it okay so now cables are hooked up USB out of this into my laptop alright so the next thing is you have to go to mode right hit mode and load at the same time which is going to be pad 2 mode load all right, so that takes you to this. I hope y'all can see this. Hope y'all can see this. And then you're gonna move the cursor all the way till you see USB. Now it says connected. See that? It's connected. So once you see that, you should see something pop up on your desktop, and that's gonna be your your uh, hard drive for the NPC. See that? Okay. So now you open that up. This is stuff that I already have on there. So all I'm going to do is drag it on to the hard drive. And now it's in there. Right? 
what's in there. Now, that's done. I'm going to exit out of this. So, now I'm going to go to my mode, load. I'm loading the program. All right, so I go to load program, mode, load. You hit mode, load. And that takes you to this page. Right? Program. You're going to find the folder that you just created, which was choppy. There it is. And then, do it. It's going to ask you to clear memory. Say, yes, clear memory. And then do it again. Now hit sequence. Got to take you to your main page. And then you should have all the sounds that's chopped up. Not sure about the actual fine tuning and all that kind of stuff, but you know, that's just it's free. How can you complain? It's free, <laughs> it's just another way to do it. So, I can't answer all the questions about this because I'm not an expert. I just wanted to share this information. So, once you have your chops, you can do what you want to do with it. You know, the other way is to just like if you already have a bunch of sounds, like say you got a kit, whatever kit you have. And you want to drag a drum here or a snare here, a hi-hat there. Just create your own programs. Hope y'all get a benefit out of this. And I'll check y'all out next time. All right? So if you like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. I really appreciate it. Subscribe. That way you will get all notifications whenever I upload a new video. More vids to come. Thanks for watching once again. Come check out the website for more information and all that good stuff. Get your free drum kit. And I'll check y'all out on the next one. Peace.